Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Golden Sun with me, Oxfu, and we are in the depths. Depths? I gotta, I gotta be able to pronounce these words correctly. Come on! Of Lunpa Fortress. Although I, I don't know if I'd actually call it a fortress. I guess it's kind of like I don't know because it's 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 hewn from the from the from the raw stone walls. Uh. I don't know, just something about this doesn't really seem... I guess it's kind of fortressy. I don't know, when, when when I think fortress, I think like... Small military installation, medieval insta mil medieval military installation, jeez. Can I get that, those words out? Um, that sort of resembles a castle? I guess it can be hewn into the rock wall like that, but... Like this, but I don't know. I don't know what else I'd call it, though, so I guess Fortress is okay. Ooh, a goody, what's in here? A vial! Always can use those. Because, you know, losing health. That is so vile. Ha 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 ha! Ha ha ha! let's give a couple of these to... To Ivan! Because, you know, he could use them. He could use all the health. Alright. Um... There we go. What do you have to say, old man? What do you have to say? Who goes there? Yeah, it's just me, old man. Jeez, calm down. Who, who, who are you? Oh God, I I nearly had a heart attack. You don't look nearly as mean as the thieves in the fortress. Well, I'm not one of the thieves into the fortress. Just you know. Did you sneak into Lunpa Fortress in search of something? Well, yes, I did. Oh, you do know the great merchant Hammett. Well, oh, you don't know him, or you don't know where he is. That's too bad. You know. We're gonna have to kill you now, just so that people don't know we're here. Just kidding. Plenty of people saw us, so we're just gonna read your mind instead. Uh, maybe the maybe the merchant is the reason they're closed off the lower caves. I don't know. I'm just an old man. Leave me alone. <laughs> All right, old man. Go have fun standing in a corner some more. You crazy old coot. Ooh, what's this? Oh my God! There's a patrolling guard now. Quick, quick. Go all, go all Splinter Cell. Can't see me, can't see me, can't see me. Uh, it's not really Splinter Cell, it's more like, uh... I'm trying to think what's a game with good invisibility, because, I mean, Splinter Cell doesn't have invisibility. It's like the stealth camo from, uh... From, uh, Metal Gear Solid. One, two, three, I think they have it in four as well. Look at me. Can't see me. I'm, I'm stealthy. Like a snake. A solid snake. Huh. Oh! Oh crap! Shoot, I forgot to use cloak, except you're a red bandana, so we actually fight you. Hey, intruder! You think you're going any farther? Hulk! Huh? Sorry, but you're gonna have to fight your way through. Oh, I will. I will cleave a path right through your breastbone and out your spine. How does that sound? Oh, actually, that, uh, that doesn't sound very- Oh my god! Oh, wait, wait. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, ow. Jeez, I'm just I'm just realizing like how terrible these are. I mean, okay, I, maybe maybe a uh, flash bolt isn't too bad. I mean, it is just uh, it is just electricity. Maybe it's not too bad. But I mean, did you see Mia's attack? She brought up like a spire of ground from the depths of the earth. And just plunge them straight through his body. That's that's terrible. I mean, a normal person is dead right after that. And I mean, this guy pretty much is a normal person. Look, he's already dead. He's just a brigand. He doesn't even know any synergy or anything. That's ter. Oh my god, you guys are, you guys are terrible. You should have just attacked him with regular swords. I mean, I know he's dead now, but still, I'm gonna shut up now. Papa misbehaves and makes Mama worry. I have to be good so Mama won't have to worry so much, and so that Papa don't doesn't beat me. <laughs> When my papa's gone, I, done, papa, shall protect Lunpa by myself. Lunpa myself. Ah, you're a sweet little kid. I hate your dad though. I'm gonna kill him. Sorry about that. So you're gonna lead. You're gonna protect Lunpa even sooner than you thought. Papa always gets friendly with the ladies when Mama's not looking. That's why Mama always keep always keeps a sharp eye on Papa. Oh, I, I. Oh my God, your dad's terrible. I don't even have a witty comeback to that. I mean, ugh. 
I mean, with the son, I could always just say, like, oh, hope your dad doesn't beat you. That's funny, right? But no, not uh, you. I mean, your dad's just terrible. I'm not gonna marry anyone like my papa when I grow up. That's good for you. Good for you. Good for you. Do you know my dad on pies? Uh, no, unfortunately, no. <gasps> Don't tell me he's gone off trying to relive his youth again. I took my eyes off him for a minute, and he's off chasing a new sweetheart. Well, maybe you should keep your husband more in line. Jeez, maybe this place wouldn't be so terrible, and you wouldn't have to live in a cave if that was the case. Not gonna make an Afghanistan joke. I'm better than that. <laughs> We've already decided that Don Papa will be Don Papa's successor. At least that tradition won't change. Well, good. He's, he seems like a stand-up guy, but I think I really think your daughter should, uh, you know, take over the family business. Maybe give the ladies a chance. Cause I mean, look, look. Good head on her shoulders. Good head on her shoulders. And I bet, I bet. Your daughter's child is so well behaved. I can't believe he's his father's son. It's a pity that child can't have an innocent childhood. Look at this. All the ladies in the family, fine. Fine. I mean, the men, two out of three, I guess they're fine. From what I hear, Lunpo was a pretty good guy. And from what I hear, Donpa was a pretty good uh, good guy. But the Donpa? Uh-uh. I mean, that, that, doesn't, that just doesn't fly right with me. Ugh. I mean, especially, 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 listen to these girls, listen to, listen to how terrible he is. Poor, poor Donpa. The Donpa's behavior is driving him into despair. Donpa can't last much longer like this. No, that's not, that's, if Donpa dies, the Donpa will be even more, oh, I get scared just thinking about it. Yeah, see, see, see how he treats the women around here. It's terrible. Nearly all of these women were brought here against their will, like me. That guy needs to go. I'm gonna kick his ass. Just saying. <sighs> I just want to go back to my hometown just one more time. You will. Don't worry. I'm gonna kick Donpa's ass. I'm gonna save you all. Don't worry about it. This is this is this is everything's gonna be all right. Just wait a little while. We are here, and I'm not just saying Isaac. Get that right. Isaac, Garrett, Ivan, and Mia are all here to kick ass and take names. So we're gonna take it. Do that right now. Oh, we're really gonna be in for if we let these kids get away. Yeah, well, like I just said, we're in. We're here to kick out and take names. So tell me your names right now. You don't go any further. Not without some serious bruises anyway. Good. Bring on the bruises. You guys are gonna be dead. <laughs> this is really fun. Not gonna lie. I, I, I was I was wondering how I was gonna actually uh, deal with Lunpa this time around. Oh my god, look at this. Just, oh, huge vines of briars just going through their body. I guess being attacked by bubbles isn't too terribly bad. I mean, come on, it's bubbles. Blast of fire. Another blast of fire. These guys are probably in the worst pain of their lives. And they're in a game. They probably had to take some sort of like hazing that they thought was going to be the worst thing in their lives but no this is probably this is probably the worst i mean now let's electrocute them now let's throw bubbles at them again look at this look at this oh i can't sorry guys but there's no way for us to really take you guys out an easy way except using synergy unless we you want us to like summon a god or something that you probably don't believe in and then you're being killed by a god. I think that's terrible. Oh, you're not dead. You guys are tougher than we thought. Well, there you go this time. Oh my god, I feel so terrible now. You guys aren't dead. Alright, alright, we give up. If you're here for him, he's down in the cave. Go get him already. Oh, hey, don't you hurt me again, you thieving sound. Oh, everything, everything is paid. Oh, even, even my eyebrows, even my eyebrows are, are in pain. Even even the hair on top of my head is hurting. <laughs> oh, come on, not another thing. You scoundrel! You're the scoundrel. The Donpa always said you'd come, and here you are. Wait, wait, wait. the Donpa said we'd come? But how, how, wait. 
Oh my god, is he an adept too? Can he s see the future? No, no, he can't. It's just... I don't think they thought out that line very well. Eh, it's one line out of a pretty good... A pretty good game, a pretty well-written game, so... Not really a complaint, it's just... Ha! <laughs> that's a funny line. Uh... Alright, let's heal up a little. Mia, you've got Wish. You've got plenty of PP, so let's get on that. Alright, I'm trying to think. Do... Uh, no, I don't wanna, I don't wanna do that. How about, uh... Ooh, that actually does quite a bit. Yeah, let's get rid of, let's get a granite, get rid of granite. Oh man. Garrett, you treat those Jin. you treat them so well, but they just take you for granted. <laughs> did I already use that joke? I think I did. Or something like that. Shh, please don't wake the Don- or, <laughs> that's the wrong voice. A little lower. Please don't wake Don Pao. He's been driven to despair after battling a terrible foe. It's all because of that to Don Pao. <laughs> Are you the one who Dampa said will come to punish the Dampa? Why, no. But I am gonna punish the Dampa. I'm gonna kick his ass so hard that he's gonna. He's gonna puke shit. <laughs> That's so gross. Um. Um. <laughs> wow. Dampa's waited a long, very long time for you, honey. Dumba knows that he coddled the Dumper way too much as a child. It pains him so much he can't die with things the way they are. Maybe if the Dumper, I, the Dumper's eyes are open, Lumpa will be a good place again. Maybe. You know what? Maybe. Oh, I keep hitting reveal on accident. If someone punished the Dumper, I'm sure the Dumper would offer a reward. He might even give that person the Dumper's ill-gotten goods. Oh, father, I'm so sorry about the Dunpa. Someone will teach him a lesson not to someday. Of course, not me. I mean, I, I like spoiling him as a child, because it means I get to play with the, the toys and stuff that I spoiled him with. Uh, on second thought, maybe I was not the best father. Uh, oh, God. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, let's just dodge another slowly walking guard. This seems easy enough. Yeah, that seems. It. Oh my god, oh my god. Do you see? Do you guys? Do you see that? Do you see that? Do you see that? Oh my god, we actually get to use catch, and not just get a nut. Hell to the freaking yeah! Finally useful. Oh man. Oh come on, we don't have to fight another red shirt. Oh, red bandana, sorry. <laughs> but they are like red shirts, they're all dying, except for those three guys that I... Oh my god, I don't want to think about that. So I won't. Instead, I'll just revel in this Pepsi that I'm gonna take a sip of. And it'll all be... it'll all be fine. Yeah. <laughs> oh god, what have I done? And actually, let's see some gin. We haven't been using them quite enough. We've been, we've been using synergy out the out the ass, but for, for gin? No, look, look at look at how easy that was. One turn. Oh man, we should use gin more often. I'm totally playing with one hand right now, and it is fantastic. All right, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. This got it's got nothing for us. Got nothing for you, man. Oh, it's supposed to be can't do nothing for you, man, but I'm paraphrasing, you know. People do that. Oh, wait. Oh, shoot, don't go that way. He'll see us. Well, now we've got the key, so it doesn't really matter. But, I was like, wait a minute. Can we go... There was a part that we missed, but no, I was just connected with the main hall. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Alright. Ivan, we've seen these bushes before. Use Whirlwind! For once it was super effective, it didn't just get rid of the enemy Pokemon. But what's this? <gasps> no switch on the wall! Well, if you were paying attention to what one of the guards said when I was just talking over everything, he actually said, oh, they'll never find it, it's in the wall. Plus, there's a strange outcome. Ah! Rat warriors. What are they doing here? Rats. Rats. 
Anyway, there's a strange outcropping of pebbles on the floor. So you know what that means. I mean, if I just saw like strange pebbles arranged on my on my driveway, I'd try to use psychic force to try and reveal. Obviously, it doesn't work because I'm not I'm not an adept, but I totally try. <laughs> anyway. Um, oh, hey, look another one. Rats again. Ah, oh, rats. Um, actually, I'm going to use Ember, because we're running kind of low on Synergy. Not terribly low. Excuse me. Not terribly low, it's just, uh... I feel like we could have more Synergy. Always, we could have more Synergy. I mean... We could have so much more Synergy. It, uh, I, I've got nothing to add to that. <laughs> I feel like one of my friends who will uh, tell a story and it'll sound like, oh, rising action to the story. This happened, this happened, this happened. Oh, that's the end. Yeah, that was the story. At least that's how she used to tell them in high school. She's gotten a little bit better where she actually wraps up things. Well, and like, oh, and then this happened and everything ended. But it still has the same feel. Um... Oh, she's fantastic, though. I, I don't know, just the way that she tells them, it just, it, it's perfect. It's like, um... I can't even replicate it, that's how well she does it. Because it'd be like, oh, well, Isaac, Garrett, Ivan, and Mia got in a battle, and then Isaac did some synergy, Garrett did some synergy, Ivan did some synergy, Mia did some synergy, and they, they won. <laughs> like, it, it just drops off at the end, where most people would put in more details, like, oh man, and then the vote finds rose from the ground and, like, stabbed through the kobolds and mad blast blew them all up to smithereens. She's just like, and they won. <laughs> and, I don't know, there's just something a little bit endearing about that. I mean, I've been, I've been friends with her since high school, so... And she's also going out with my best friend, so I have seen plenty of her, and I don't know, I just think that's a fantastic part of her personality that I have never been able, I, like, I've never seen anybody else be able to do that and come off as funny while doing that. <laughs> I can't even accurately explain it, because she does it so well. Oh well. In any case, let's move this box, move this box, move this box, move this box! God, it feels like we're playing uh, Wario Land again. Just, uh, you know, continuously charging against those, uh, those cast iron stoves. Breaking through boxes. There was no gin, there were no gin in that, though. It's the only thing that was missing. Could you imagine? Wario just using Fizz on uh, Captain Syrup and just drenching her, and oh god, I should probably stop now. No. <laughs> and she's wearing a white t-shirt. No, no, no. No, I'm not, I'm not even going there. Well, I mean, I did go there. I'm not going there any farther. Um, oh god. <laughs> anyway, I'm done being ridiculous with Wario and having it with Jin. <laughs> Let's get on to this. Actually, I'm gonna see you guys next time on Let's Play this game, Golden Sun, with Mio Xfu. And we'll find out what's behind door number 8957.5264. Nine. See you guys next time. Take it easy.